tomorrow. Long time, you should see what's in there now. Percival Pratt's password. Spouting riddles again, is he? I'm afraid I don't know. Try asking Professor Basil Fronsack. Are you sure you don't know the password? Sorry, I haven't got a clue. I'd ask Fronsack if I were you. Don't you two start rhyming as well? just confiscated some of Fred and George's things. Filch thinks they're bottles of love potion. What are Fred and George doing with love potion? It's not love potion, you troll. It's doxy van for the skiving snack boxes. We've got to get those bottles back, or Fred and George will be expelled. They're in Umbridge's storeroom. Harry, can you use your invisibility cloak to get the bottles back? I'll fetch it from the boys' dormitory. Dean's not put up as many West Ham posters as he normally does. Mrs. Weasley would go mad if she saw that mess. I love this thing. Now, remember, we need to be quiet, so... 
no chattering, Ron. Me? You're the one who can't come more than 20 seconds without telling someone off. We shouldn't try to cast spells while we're under here. There's not enough room. Someone will see us. We shouldn't cast while we're invisible. I hope she doesn't make us clean any more vases. I know. I see one more vase, I'll be sick. How are we going to get past them? We'll have to find a way to distract them. Something that gets them away from Umbridge's door. I told you, don't cast spells while we're under the cloak. this stuff. It's a wonder there are still things left to confiscate. How are we going to find the bottles in all this? Accio and Doxy Venom. Yeah, that's, that's what I was going to do. <sighs> Let's get out of here. With Fred and George nowhere near here, she can't blame them either. They wouldn't get blamed if they weren't involved in this sort of thing in the first place. Come on, let's get back to the Gryffindor common room. That cloak always comes in handy. Thank <laughs> you. 
Great! I'll return them to Fred and George. And tell them to be more careful. It's not that I approve, but I wouldn't want them to be expelled. It's not them being expelled that would be bad. It'd be the howl as Mum would send. Yeah. Ronald Weasley, how dare you let your brothers be expelled from school? I'll see you at the DA meeting. going to come and look at our room, Harry. It's almost as nice as my toilet. <laughs> Every time you discover things, my file gets heavier. You don't know how lucky you are that portraits can't jinx. massive fan of the books and I'd read I think the first and the second and uh, yeah then Newsround were advertising kids to um, send in like application forms and that and my mum videoed me doing this I made this like rap song of <laughs> how much I wanted to be in the film and are you a talking gargoyle? Do you normally talk to ones that can't speak? I don't normally talk to gargoyles or should imagine many gargoyles are grateful for that Ginny was obviously the youngest and the only girl, so that's quite a lot of pressure. But I think it's quite fun at the same time, because I can kind of, as a character, you can, she can kind of get away with things. Well done, Ginny. Blowing things up comes naturally when you've grown up with Fred and George. Because, I've, because I'm not doing school now, we've got more time to play on the game, so it's good. I do quite like the, like the action-adventure, like the Harry Potter game. completely exceeded all of my expectations of quite what a video game could achieve in terms of realness. I think a lot of people can relate to the characters because you know, there's Hermione who's you know, the really brainy one who always kind of thinks one step ahead and you know Harry's obviously the brave but quite quiet at the same time but then Ron's kind of the jokingly one. Kids can sort of, uh, sort of relate to the, the whole school side of it because um, I mean they, 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 do, they have lessons, they have exams and stuff. So they can sort of relate to that side, but they've also got the whole sort of magic thing with giants and, and all these sort of amazing sort of creatures. A lot of films, especially and in games, it's all always well, the adult who comes to it and they're always the big, the big hero, whereas in Harry Potter it sort of shows, especially in, in this one, in the Order of the Phoenix, how the, the adults you know, have got it wrong, like Umbridge isn't making sense all the time, and Harry and everyone know that. Accio Brew! One of the other important things for us on this game was also to bring our characters to life and to bring them a lot closer to, to the film and to the actors that, that people know. This time we really, really want people to feel like they're looking at the, the film characters in the game. And so we've, we've gone through uh, with the actors and uh, done head scans uh, of all the actors uh, to incorporate them into the game.
cursed me with you. All your discoveries are making my arm ache. Hi, Hannah. What are you doing? I, I... I need to think, to remember. Oh, I'm never going to finish my revision. Well, we can help you with one subject. We're having our first Defense Against the Dark Arts meeting. M meeting? At Umbridge's Bands Clubs? She'll see us going there. I'll fail my OWLs. I'll be expelled. We'll all be expelled. It's all right. We're going to use a secret passage to get people to the meeting. Really? Where is it? We'll, uh, tell you later. Come on, Harry. Well, now we'll have to find a secret passage to the seventh floor or Hannah won't come. There has to be one somewhere on the grand staircase. Let's look. Excuse me, do you know where there's a secret passage from here to the seventh floor? Yes, of course I do. I am the guardian of that passage. Great. Can you let us in? My password is Scarlet Scoundrel. Password? Scurrilous Scoundrel. Just say Scurrilous Scoundrel to the portrait of the astronomer on the seventh floor. You can use the passage to get to the meeting. That way, no one will see you getting there. Thanks. Justin Finch Fletchley's promised to help me with my charms. I'll tell him about the meeting too. Is there a secret passage behind your portrait? And what is that to you, boy? You are not Slytherin, so you cannot pass. Unless you have the password, of course. No, I don't. I thought not. Still, you could try asking some Slytherin students. I'm sure they'd be happy to help you. I love this thing. Let's see Umbridge catch me now. We shouldn't cast while we're invisible.
We got potions. We'll be late. Not if we use the secret passage near the entrance of the dungeon corridor. Then we'll get there in no time. Do you know the password? Of course. Such a shame people who aren't in Slytherin don't. Can you remember the password? Of course. Just make sure there's no one here with you when we go in. Here we are. Password. Slytherins are supreme. Pass, Slytherins. And remember, be nasty to mudbloods. <laughs> Slytherins are supreme. Not now. I know their precious password. That was fun. Please, can you tell me the password? Find three faces, as I've said, or simply stand around instead. Are you sure you don't know the password? Sorry, I haven't got a clue. I'd ask Fronsac if I were you. Don't you two start rhyming as well? Password? Scurrilous scoundrel.
Wingardium Leviosa! Mum would love that. Leviosa! I wish I was as good at Quidditch as you. Can you help me with my homework? There's Susan. We should tell her about the Room of Requirement. What's she doing with Crab and Goyle? You think you're special just because you're answering the Ministry. My father reckons your aunt's a troublemaker. Someone will teach her a lesson. Leave me alone. Did you see Potter and Potions? Harry! Hermione! Ron! Hey! Harry, please help! Oh, look! They've come to save their little friend. Come on then, Potter. What are you going to do? How can we get past? You'll have to use your wand. Let's jinx the toe rags. We have to get them away from Susan so we can talk to her. Well, really. Protego! You were brilliant. Don't worry. I'm sure you do the same for us. I wish I was as good as you at dueling. Then you should come to our DA meeting. It's on the seventh floor in the Room of Requirement. Great. Thanks. I'm good. You should be in today, my Hi. I'm not talking to you, Potter. My mum almost banned me from school because of you. Yeah, yeah.
are more things to see in the room we found, Harry. You must have been busy. We've not found everyone yet. Check your map. The others... Yosa! Look at the DA list and decide who to find next. Too. We found somewhere for the DA to practice. I hope you're not breaking school rules. We wouldn't dream of it, would we, Fred? Not with so many prefects around. We're merely storing items where they won't disturb oversensitive individuals, like Umbridge and Filch. Will you give us a hand? We need someone to go up inside the boathouse. We'll lift the boxes up to you, then if you can pop them in the boat, it will be much appreciated. And it's Harry Potter. He's past the starting line. He's climbing up the ladders. You need to lift the cover off each boat. Pop the boxes inside and cover them up. Then put the cover back and it's mission accomplished. Brilliant! OK, Harry, we'll pass the boxes up. Just put them in the boat. No problem! This is going to be so good. 
okay? That's the way! Right! Almost there! Keep going! Wingardium Leviosa! Done it! We knew you wouldn't let us down! No problem! Brilliant! Okay! Now cover the box up with the tarpaulin! Brilliant! Come on down! I think he's earned a reward. How about a little preview? Careful! Ron and Hermione might have to put us in detention. What is in those boxes? Want to find out? Then cast Reducto or Incendio on that box. Yeah, think of it as helping us with our research. Just cast Reducto or Incendio on the box. Amazing! Glad you think so. And thank you for helping with our research. What research? You, you just proved the fireworks are idiot proof. We better go. See you at the DA meeting. Seventh floor, room of requirement. Cool. We'll be there. The Pulso! Blood. You're so funny.
India. Hi. Did you get all the books from Diagon Alley? I think I forgot one. Oh. Need a hearing again, you silly. Ignore them, Harry. There are lots of new things to see in our secret room, Harry. Huh? <laughs> I don't really have time for chit chat right now. Guardian Leviosa.
Tokyo. Deposo. Did you see Potter and Poaches? He got another zero. Hi. 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 What a new telescope. What to come with his astronomy? Greetings. All right. Wingardium Leviosa!
Bear's always happy. I wonder what his secret is. Wingardium Leviosa! Okay, Harry. Hi! Isn't that Michael Corner? Hi, is it true there's a DA meeting later? I heard you'd found somewhere for the DA to meet. What? This is supposed to be secret. It's all right. I heard it from Ernie, who heard it from Neville. We'll see you there then, yeah? Yeah, okay. I don't know if Terry or Anthony knows. You'd better tell them. I'll tell Ginny if I see her. Why is he going to tell Ginny? Come on, we've not found everyone yet. I'm missing three cards, that's all. Have you got them? Hi to you too. Hi, Harry. <laughs> Wingardium Leviosa! I really want to go to Hogsmeade next time. Are you coming? Did you see him? Hey, Harry. Hi, Padma, Pavati. Uh... Can you make it to a DA meeting later? Well, we're supposed to be meeting Professor Trelawney. She's going to interpret a dream I had. Well, can you come after that? I don't know. Meet us at Divination and we can tell you then. Bye. Bye. What was that about? Don't ask me. pam has been funny with me ever since the Yule Ball. She's still upset because you didn't dance with her. She's not said anything. Oh, Ron. With girls, it's what we don't say that matters. You should write a book. Translating mad things girls do so boys can understand them. Potter stinks! Hi to you too. How are you? All right. Get lost, Potter! How are you? Okay. Hey! Hey!
glad the sorting hat put me in Slytherin. Want another adventure? Dragon's Egg. Pass, friend to Hufflepuff. Keep it up. Oh, to be young. Chops and gravy. Mmm, yummy. Please, can you tell me the password? Find three faces, as I've said, or simply stand around and stare. You ready to come to the meeting? We haven't been in yet. That toad, Umbridge, is in there with Professor Trelawney. Umbridge has had it in for Professor Trelawney ever since that stupid inspection she did. You c can't sack me. I've been here 16 years. Hogwarts is my, my home. <laughs> should have seen this coming. Looks like your divination class has been cancelled. Poor oh, Professor Trelawney. Count us in for the DA meeting. Anything to show that Umbridge woman. Harry? I'll see what I can find. Come on, Harry. You must know something good you can teach us. I think I know just the spell. How about this one, Harry? Reducto. Didn't you use that during the Triwizard Tournament? It says you need to aim, then rotate your wand anti-clockwise, and say, Reducto. Reducto! Reducto! Just watch me. Great, show me again. Brilliant. Well done, Ginny. Blowing things up comes naturally when you've grown up with Fred and George. Right. Let's see if anyone here is as good as Ginny. Thanks for teaching that to us, Harry. Sorry, I I've forgotten what I wanted to say. I don't mind what we practice. You pick a spell, Harry. I wonder if Fred and George will let me work for them when I leave Hogwarts. The dummy? Is that the Death Eater? That Umbridge woman looks a bit like a toad, doesn't she? Did you know Ginny Weasley and Michael Corner were going out? Reductor was great. I think the others have some ideas about what you could teach us next.
about? Scurrilous scoundrel. Hi, Colin. What are you doing? I tried to take a photograph of some Slytherins bullying a first year, you know, so we'd have evidence. But they threw my camera on the roof. Don't worry. Harry will get it back for you. You will? Thanks, Harry. That's brilliant. It's up there. How are you going to get it? Whatever you do, I bet it'll be cool. Planting these things. We'll help Harry. This plant is going to stop Harry. Wingardium Leviosa. Great team, don't we, Harry? Oh, wow! You're great, Harry! Climbing, Harry. This is so cool. I wish I had my camera. Reparo! <laughs> Brilliant. You're almost there, Harry. I'm here to catch it. Well done, Harry. Try using Wingardium Leviosa to pass it down to us. Wingardium Leviosa! Oh, Harry, thanks. You're great. I wish I could cast magic like that. Just wait till I tell Dennis. 
Harry Potter helped me get my camera back. Dennis will be so jealous. Harry, do you think you could tell him the story of how you got my camera back? Maybe Harry will tell Dennis if you bring him to the DA meeting. Yeah, of course. I'm not going to miss any of those meetings. Harry, you're going to be a great teacher, I know it. Come to the room of requirement on the seventh floor. Yeah, OK, I'll be there. Is it OK if I bring my camera? No, probably not. We don't want photos of a secret meeting. I won't bring it then. Great, no problem. Thanks again, Harry. I'll see you later. Bye. I think he's eaten too many chocolate frogs. And his brother's worse. Yes, well, at least they both believe Harry. We need as many people on our side as we can get. In it. You could see all the way to Hogsmeade if there weren't all those trees and we were facing the right way in. Where is Hogsmeade anyway? I wish I'd taken divination instead of her. There are lots of new things to see in our secret room, Harry. Harry, what do you Get lost, pipsqueak. Hi. I have guarded this passage faithfully for years, you know. Not one person has passed this way. Not one person knows the password. Well, if no one knows the password, then no one can pass that way. So you're not really doing your job. But, if you want to tell me the password... Yes, well, I have to say that makes more bally sense than anything I've heard in a long time. Ah, but, but, but I, I can't tell you with this lot around. You'll have to get rid of everyone. Why are there so many mudbloods at Hogwarts? They should have listened to Salazar Slytherin and banned them. Watch out, is Potty Potter. You think he's mad because he spends so much time with mudbloods? Point your wand at them! <laughs> Akio, do you think we're scared of you? There. Everyone's gone. Please, tell me the password before they come back. Very well. It is Volo Futurus Unus. Volo what? I want to be alone. Volo Futurus Unus. Pass for friend. Daily profit today, Potter. You're not funny. I'm just glad the sort of happy means.
Is that Professor Bin's homework for History of Magic? Yeah. We've got to list five talking gargoyles. I've looked in Hogwarts of history, but it doesn't say where they are. I can't even remember Bin's talking about gargoyles. Is that boring? Can I borrow your notes, Hermione? No! Terrific. Can you let me know when you find them all? That'd be cool. Yeah, okay. We'll need to keep our eyes and ears open. There are gargoyles all over Hogwarts, but only some of them can talk. I think there's a talking gargoyle somewhere near here. Are you a talking gargoyle? You normally talk to ones that can't speak. I don't normally talk to gargoyles. Or should imagine many gargoyles are grateful for that. Thanks for talking to us. Let's go. She didn't seem very happy. That's one gargoyle found. Potter, Weasley, Miss Granger, I have a little task for you. By you, I mean Gryffindor's two new prefects. Yes, Professor? I am standing here in expectation of a group of first-year boys arriving for detention. However, by all reports, they are hiding in the Divination Tower instead. Please tell them to come here immediately. Of course, Professor McGonagall. There's no way I would have ignored Professor McGonagall when I was a first year. No, of course not, Ronald. In your first year, all you did was fight a troll, save an illegal dragon, and ignore the advice of Professor Dumbledore so Harry could fight Professor Quirrell. <laughs> Let's go to the Divination Tower. Been in the Daily Prophet today, Potter. See ya. Dragon's Egg. May your courage hold. To be young again. Hello. Step slowly and walk short. Else you'll fall. Did you really fight he who must not be named? And some big snake thing in the second year. And win the Triwizard Tournament? Yeah. Wow. And Professor McGonagall told Harry here to find some slotty-nosed first years who are cheeky enough not to turn up to her detention. She said if you didn't go, then Harry could feed you all to the dragon that lives in the kitchens. There's not really a dragon in the kitchens. Is there? Want to find out? Then hop it. I don't remember making things up to terrify first years, being in our talk on how to be prefects. Yeah, well, the midges need to learn a little respect.
Are you sure you don't know the password? Sorry, I haven't got a clue. I'd ask Fronsac if I were you. Don't you two start rhyming as well? Build. Scoverless scoundrel. You don't know where the other talking gargoyles are, do you? I haven't seen another gargoyle since the one on that plinth disappeared. What happened to him? About a year ago, some boy flew through here being chased by a dragon. It knocked my friend right over the edge. Uh... Come back and talk to me sometime, won't you? This is a great place for a picnic. Come around any time. It wasn't your fault, Harry. Do you think they're all that mental? Keeping your eyes open for gargoyles. Volo Futurus Eunus. Oh, well remembered. If you need to practice your charms, you can always talk to Professor Dick. You know the password for Percival Pratt's portrait? Ever inquiring, Mr. Potter, that's good to see. Well, your voyage of discovery will need to take you to the shepherdess on the second floor landing. Balder Dash and Piff. Chops and gravy. Dripping in gravy. Yum, yum, yum. Hello. Akio! Anything about anything in the summer, my parents are mine. 
Hey. Hi. All right. Slithering for the car. You're not funny. We need to keep our eyes and ears open. There are gargoyles all over Hogwarts, but only some of them can talk. Are you still keeping your eyes open for gargoyles? Flaming earwigs. Ah, they're everywhere. Wingardium Leviosa! Depulso! Okay, Harry. Hey! Please, can you tell me the password? Find three faces, as I've said. Please, can you tell me the password? Find three. F I'm so tired today. Chops and gravy. <clears throat> Better out than in. Hello. Hi. Hi.
Tyrants are so immature. Are you still keeping your eyes open? There's Terry. We should tell them about the meeting. Do you think he could look any more stupid? Hello, Harry. I heard you found someone for the DA to meet. Does everyone know about our secret meeting place? Uh, did you kill a basilisk with the sword from Dumbledore's office? We're learning how to use spells, not swords. Oh, OK. I don't know if Michael or Anthony knows where to meet. You better tell them. See you later. Reparo! How are you? Hi. Wingardium Leviosa! You think he's mad because he spends so much time with mud bloods? Bye. You're so funny. I think that's a moly plant. I think that's a moly plant. Incendio! There's Ernie. We haven't told him about the DA meeting yet. Hey, Ernie. We found somewhere for the DA to practice. Sorry, I can't come just now. I'm trying to get Snape's homework done. Have you completed yours yet? Which one? We have to procure the ingredients for tomorrow's lesson. Oh, honestly, Harry, haven't you found them yet? And when am I supposed to do that? I've got all my other homework, Umbridge's attentions, and I'm teaching you Defense Against the Dark Arts. No need to be so irritable. Listen, you find five moly plants on a mandrake root, and I'll find the other potion ingredients for you. Where am I supposed to find those things? Well, Professor Sprout has mandrakes in the Herbology greenhouse, and moly plants grow in the castle grounds, so we just have to look for those. Does she know everything? <laughs> Oh, 
you going to get those moly things, Harry? That's one moly plant, Harry. Now we need four more. So that's a moly plant. I wonder what it was I put in my potion last lesson. Oh, Ron. No wonder your potion turned orange. Better than Goyle's. He's burned a hole in his cauldron. Professor Sprout said there were moly plants around here. Great, now we only need three more plants. Are you going to get those moly things, Harry? Brilliant, Harry. We only need two more. I know Harry and I haven't taken arithmetic <laughs> like you, Mike. We can count to five. This would be a good place to look. That's four plants. We still need one more, though. You're going to get those moly things, Harry. That's all those moly plant things. But we've still got to get that mandrake root. Snake never gives us easy homework, does he? We'll have to go to the herbology greenhouses. Guardian Leviosa! I think we should stay outside, in case Filch turns up. Filch is in the dungeons. A lot of first years brought puking pastels and covered the place in... Ow! Outside, Ron. What was that for? Oh, Ron, honestly. Oh, hi, Harry. How are you? Fine. Has Gryffindor got a new keeper yet? Yeah, it's my friend, Ron Weasley. The Tornado's hater. Yeah. You sending a package? Yes, a present for my mum's birthday. But I forgot to put the address on it and now the owl's flown up there and won't come down. I'll get it for you. <laughs> oh, very funny.
We didn't learn about this in care of magical creatures. Thanks. Thanks. Keep going, Harry. <laughs> Wingardium Leviosa! I think that owl's allergic to me. <laughs> we'll have to find a way to climb up to him. Good job Hagrid's not watching. I mean, me too. I was wondering if, uh... Yes? I mean, would you like to, uh, to bring Marietta to the meeting as well? It's in the room of requirement. Oh. Yes. All right, then. Great. I'll see you later, then. Yeah, of course. How did it go? How did what go? Oh, nothing. Sometimes you make no sense at all, Hermione. That's because you have the emotional range of a teaspoon, Ronald. Chops and gravy. Mmm, yummy.
dragon's egg. I look forward to your future exploits, Mr. Potter. Potter, Weasley, Miss Granger, what's this I hear about dragons in the kitchens? Please don't tell first years things like that. Someone's bound to be silly enough to believe you and go looking for them. However, ten points to Gryffindor for ingenuity. in here. Potter, Weasley and Miss Granger, I trust you're up to date with your homework. Don't forget, I'm expecting your essay on self-fertilising shrubs for tomorrow's lesson, and I hope I don't have to remind you that this is your owl, yeah? No, Professor Sprout. She hoped she didn't have to remind us. As if we could forget. Every teacher keeps reminding us every lesson. Where are we going to find a book on self-fertilizing shrubs? Neville will explain. Let's find him. Come on, Harry. That's the mandrake root there. The in the second year. We can take these off now. What? I said. What? We can take these off now. No need to shout. Better get this lot back to Ernie so he can get them ready for potions. <laughs> Percival Pratt's password. Me? No, no, no. Now that Google Stump fellow, you know, in that hall near the viaduct, he's a portrait with answers. Do you know where Rowena Ravenclaw came from? Yeah, of course. Rowena Ravenclaw is from the Glen. Right. Thanks. Great. Better get this lot back to Ernie so he can get them ready for potions. I hope the three of you have completed your research into counter charms for your homework. Remember, your OWL exams may influence your futures for many years to come. Yes, of course, Professor. There's just one more counter charm I need to check before I hand my essay in. Uh, yeah, me too. I know the perfect book. Achievements in Charming. But it's been checked out from the library. We'll need to find whoever has it.
have been fun, are we? Oh, great. Zachariah Smith. Do we have to tell him where the meeting is? Yes, we need to keep him in the DA now that he knows about it. Are you well? We've got a meeting later. No, I've got too much work to do, and my schoolwork must come first. I'd have thought you would have understood that. Of course. So if we help you with your homework, then you'll come to the meeting? What? Shh. I suppose. But I've got to get a copy of the Monster Book of Monsters first. OK, fine. We'll get that for you. Hermione! Let's find the Monster Book of Monsters. Hey. Do you know where Rowena Ravenclaw came from? Yeah, of course. Rowena Ravenclaw was from the Glens. Right. Thanks. This is the right section. The Monster Book of Monsters should be around here. That's the book Zacharias wants. Nice one, Harry. Let's give it to Zacharias. Here. Now. The DA meeting. No way. I'm still knee-deep in work. Yes, but you did say... Get me some Wigan World potion from the hospital wing, and then I might be able to come. Fine. Here, blimey, if it isn't Harry Potter. Read all about you, I has. Everything. Always in the paper, you are. Uh, yeah. Only most of it's not true. Not true? Not true? It's in black and white, isn't it? Gotta be true. Mine, it's been days since I've seen a paper. Yeah. Can I use the shortcut behind your portrait? Oh, no, no staff only. Mine, I could make an exception. You tell me what the headline of the Daily Prophet is today, and I'll let you through. All right. He keeps this up. He'll be going to the hospital wing. Talking gargoyle? Knock, knock. Who's there? Twit. Twit who? Sorry, didn't realise you were an owl. <laughs> Are all the gargoyles mental? No, don't go. I've got loads more. How many left now? Three down, two to go. Wonder where they are. I hope Hedwig's all right. find talking gargoyles for Professor Finn's homework. Hello, Harry. <laughs> Incendio! 
Garcia. Must be the holidays again. Excuse me, do you guard a secret passage? Hmm? Do you guard a secret passage? Uh, yes, I do. But I haven't heard the password in oh, must be 50 years. Yes, 50 years. Unless you know someone who might have been here 50 years ago, you might find it difficult to get my password. 